обстрел города. Almost 700 facilities have been damaged in Belgorod over one week by shelling attacks by Ukrainian troops, city mayor Valentin Demidov said. It shall be noted that Belgorod has been regularly targeted by Ukrainian attacks since Russia launched its full-scale invasion in February 2022. Regional Governor Vyacheslav Gladkov said last month that 120 civilians had been killed and more than 650 others had been wounded in Belgorod since the start of the war. According to Valentin Demidov over the past week, as a result of shelling attacks, 687 facilities have sustained new damage, 213 facilities have been restored as well as 120 windows and 145 balconies have been repaired over one week. Some 2,620 facilities are currently being restored. Some 161 vehicles have been damaged over the week. Demidov added that it is planned to repair all the damaged windows in Belgorod by June 10th and all the balconies by June 25th. Recently, Russian air defense systems shot down two Alka projectiles over the Belgorod region bordering Ukraine. Russian Defense Ministry said that the Kiev regime's attempted attack on facilities in Russia's territory with the use of an Alka multiple launch missile system was thwarted. Russian air defense systems destroyed two Ukrainian Alka MLRS projectiles over the Belgorod region. A woman was hurt in the city of Shebekino after Ukraine's missile attack, the region's governor, Vyacheslav Gladkov, said. Our defense system operated over the Shebekino municipal district, two Alka MLRS projectiles approaching the city were shot down. According to preliminary data, a woman was hurt. She was taken to hospital he wrote on his Telegram channel. Apart from that, according to the governor, a kamikaze drone hit a window in a single-family house in the village of Novostrov Purveya. Luckily, no one was hurt. The drone broke windows and damaged the facade and a gas boiler, he wrote. A passenger car was damaged in another drone attack, he added.